Hey, what's up, YouTube viewers? You're tuning in here with yours truly, Wanna Be Native. This is just going to be a quick video, and it is a message to native speakers. Yes, a message to native speakers. Basically, this video is for those of you whose mother tongue is Arabic, Hebrew, or Hindi. If your mother tongue is Arabic, Hebrew, or Hindi, which are the three languages that I'm learning for this year so far, I would love for you guys to become a part of my channel. All right, I would love for you to contact me through YouTube some way, friend, friend request me, send me a message, or whatever you want to do. I would love to connect with you somehow so that I can get this project that I have going on on YouTube underway. So I can get it rolling and get it started, just jump started, and so that we can get serious about this. Because, again, the whole reason for this channel that I've created is to draw in native speakers of the languages that I'm studying so that I can have conversations with you guys, daily conversations, average, everyday conversations that you would hear on the street with you guys to help help me learn. And it would be really awesome if you guys could help me out with this project that I have going on here. It would be even better if you guys could video response to me, send me a video, that would be that would just be so much appreciated by me if you could just say or or comment and say hey you need to work on this your accents off or whatever or hey you're doing really good on this keep it up so that I can correct the things that I'm doing wrong and stop doing them fix them and so that I can continue to do the things that I'm doing right so I don't accidentally change something that I'm doing right and start doing it wrong because again I will value native speakers opinion over any book, any resource that I learn something from. I will always value you guys' opinion over that book because really, like when you weigh it out on a scale, native speakers opinion, random resource book that I have. You know, you guys are the ones who speak the language. You guys are the one who have been learning the language since you were a little baby. And so I will always value your opinions over the resources. And again, I just want to reach out to the rest of the world from this small town that I live in, in Colorado, because it's a small town and it's very, it's very unlikely for me to have a encounter with a native speaker on a daily basis. You know, if I go down to like Park Meadows area or like Spring, Colorado Springs, I might hear a little bit of Hindi spoken, and again, we have a, um, we also have a concentrated Hebrew population that I know of, but you know, that's really like, um, it's, it's uncommon for, for me to run into those people, you know, and be able to practice what I'm learning, because I can't expect myself, man, these dogs barking, I can't expect myself to learn something from a book and expect myself to recall it like that someday when I travel say go to Israel or if I go to India or to the Middle East somewhere um, I can't expect myself to just recall it like that if I'm not actually practicing because practicing is what makes it second nature to you the language needs to become a part of me and I need to be able to speak it without even thinking about it and the only way I'm going to be able to do that is if I'm practicing with you guys every single day. And so that's that's really what I want to do because when I grow up, this this isn't, you know, it's a hobby for many people and that's awesome. I'm a big language enthusiast, you know, and I don't think that you only need to learn languages if you need them for a job. I think it's awesome for people who just want to learn languages just because they love it. I do that sometimes with random languages, but a lot of these languages that I've chosen to learn are languages that are going to help me with my future um, when I seek the careers that I'm moving forward in. Um, there will probably be a lot of traveling abroad and I'm probably going to have to use these someday on a higher level than the average person. So that's what I want to do here. I, I just want to get feedback from you guys, and that's what this video is all about. Because um, I do not go to public school, 
when you go to public school, you have exchange students, you know, clubs you can get involved in, you can talk to the teachers of the languages, and you get some practice there. So basically what I'm trying to do is make my own club here on YouTube and just just um, get the practice that way and just draw you guys in and get this project underway. So thanks for watching this video, guys. Again, sorry about the dogs outside barking and... I hope you guys watch my other videos and just stay tuned here. All right. I look forward to, to hearing from you guys in the future. It's Wannabe Native. Keep it here.